In the last video, the rocket was naked. It wasn't painted. Um, I've gone ahead and painted it, as you can see. Um, I did make one little modification that I didn't do on camera, and that was to drill this hole right here. This is in the switch band. So if I take this apart, you can see that there's the coupler on the inside. And I, I just drilled that hole. Um, that is for my on-off switch that will go in the eBay. Uh, at this point, I can show you the assembly of the eBay. It's pretty simple. Um, you're going to take this. This is the sled. Um, I'm going to call this end right here the front end. Um, now, you'll see that there's a bulkhead with two slots in it that this goes into. Um, you may have to sand these down a little bit so that it fits into those slots. Um, and same thing on this end. Um, it'll go into that slot right there, just like that. Uh, there's this little piece right here, and this is the, the standoff for the all thread that goes inside. Um, so this is going to get glued into that slot right there. Uh, but when you glue it in, kind of flip it over and make sure that it's centered right in the middle. Uh, because if it's off to one side, then the, then it's not going to line up perfectly. You can always, you know, open up that hole a little bit in this piece just to make sure that the all thread does go through. Because it's going to go through both of the holes and the bulkheads. Um, so I'm just going to take some medium thick super glue actually let me put it in first make sure it's aligned properly right there and i'm actually going to use since i've already got it in i'm going to use thin super glue and just let it wick in and some paper towels because i got too much on the surface And then I'll put a little bit on this right here and right here. Like I said, this is uh, just so that the all thread um, will go through the holes easier once you have it apart. Um, so now when you assemble it, um, this is going to go through here. This is going to be pretty easy. Um, but I'm going to take the all thread and I'm going to stick it through and I want to put a washer or a nut in a washer on this one end that's closest to the, the, the standoff. Um, and the purpose of that is uh, when you put these together, and I'll show you how that goes. So I'm going to put it through here and then this side is going to go through that hole. And trying to get that whole line up right there, just like that. And then you're going to take a lifting eye nut and you're going to spin that on there until the threads just come through the end. Okay, so it's just coming through right now. That's about where you want it. Um, now you can see that on this end right here, I want this nut, once this is pushed in all the way like that, I want the edge of the nut to be right with, well actually what happened to my washer? My washer, just like that. Because when you put it together, and this will be inside of that coupler, um, it will be like that. And then once you screw this one on, um, and you're going to tighten that up. Um, but what that nut does, it, it prevents that bulkhead from bowing, kind of like a drum head, uh, because we, we want it nice and straight like that. Um, and so 
when you're assembling your rocket, you'll just slide it through. Remember, these holes that we drilled into the coupler, those go forward. And so on the bulkheads, there's a little lip on the very edge right there. Um, that will be captured on the inside edge of the coupler. And you can see um, what this piece right here does. It prevents that uh, um, all thread from flopping around because you got to get that into the hole as well as the little tabs through there like that. And then we can screw it down real tight. And when you're out in the field, um, it, you don't have, have to have any tools to open this up You can because you can just grab it with your hand and untwist it. And at the same time, there are going to be shock cords attached to both ends. You can leave those attached because they're flexible and you can still spin this around um, just like that. Now, you do have the option of gluing this um, sled to the bulkhead, and that's totally up to you. Um, it does, sometimes you may not want it, you know, because it's not going to come apart because you got that little nut on it, but sometimes things can get a little bit floppy, but, um, and some people may want to glue it, but it's totally up to you as whether you glue it or not. The one end, like this side, Definitely don't glue that on there. Okay, so um, we are now ready to start installing our electronics on the board. Um, I've got a little altimeter and a battery um, and some wires and a switch. Um, and I'll start doing that in the next video.